What up guys? I hope it's all good in your hood. And today's video is going to be a men's try on haul. Oh my god! So I'm back in front of the camera filming another video for you guys. So how's your year been? Like, tell me down this in the comment section below, like, what's been up with you? I promise you, I did not mean like to take such a long break from YouTube, but I was just busy like with work, I was helping my dad out, just a bunch of boring stuff y'all really don't care about. My channel reached 900 subscribers, uh, I want to say a couple of days ago. Um, but yeah, like, I'm really excited, like, to be back filming new items, like, new content for you guys. Like, I'm really, really excited. I really want to get back into the swing of things. Hopefully, we're going to be doing two videos a week now. Hopefully, not making no promises, not making no promises. <laughs> so, this is actually going to be an L.A. haul. So, <laughs> funny story. So, I'm actually going to L.A. in July. Um, and I know you might, some of you might be thinking, like, why are you showing us these items and you're only going in July? Why are you naming this an L.A. haul? Well, I want you guys to be able to go out and purchase these things now. I don't want to wait until July and show you this, these things and, like, they're all out of stock. So, I do like to purchase things, like, in advance for my trips. Yeah, I still have, like, four or five months until the trip, but, you know, the way my bank account is, like, set up, when it's hot, like, you gotta get it, like, so, when that check is coming and it's nice, I need to go ahead and get things now. If you're not already subscribed, please go ahead and subscribe if you like men's fashion lifestyle videos um, also give this video a thumbs up if you like it oh one more thing if you like this hairstyle check out my last video to see how I created it all right so this first piece is a piece that I literally cannot wait to wear like I cannot wait to wear these so these pants are these a tearaway Adidas pants they are vintage I first saw these pants on Kim Kardashian and I literally was like I need to find a pair of those um, I'll probably like insert a picture somewhere in here to show you like her look of it but of course I was like I want to do a men's like version of that so I literally like searched high and low for these pants and could not find them however my best friend ever when it comes to looking for vintage pieces pieces I literally could not find any that were in my size so these are actually a 2x but great thing is I actually took these to a tailor and all they did was basically like just cinch in the waist so they fit like way better like I just love the fit of these so of course these but these pants have like the snaps all the way down the side um, another feature of these I really love is like the embroidered like Adidas sign on the side with purchasing the pants from eBay and the alterations, I played about $45 for it all together. I'm thinking about maybe doing like a 90s look with it, so maybe like a sweater, like crop top. I don't know. I have to see how I style this one. Alright, so this next item is from ASOS. It's this long kind of black satin robe. I want to say this item was about $45. It's one of my favorite pieces also. I think it's really cool. It has really nice like interesting embroidery on the back. I believe they're actually marketing this as like a sleepwear type of thing, which I can believe so. But satin has been something that I've really, really been obsessed with for the past couple of seasons. So I definitely wanted to get something else that's kind of like sleepwear inspired. Um, I don't really know what I would wear with this just yet. I'm thinking either another like maybe black satin shirt under it and then maybe it's like some jeans and maybe like a dressy shoe so it doesn't look too, too like sleepwear-y. <laughs> sleepwear-y, like I don't even know if that's a word. <laughs> I would definitely dress this up because you don't want to look like, you know, you're actually going to bed in this. Like you want to dress it up and make it look, you know, really nice. All right, so this next piece is from Zara. Um, it actually cost $89. Um, funny story about this item was I was actually shopping around Zara in Dallas. I had taken like a quick trip there because for whatever reason, I think I was like tax balling or something like that. Um, but uh, I actually passed this up. I actually didn't see this, but Billy saw this and he pointed it out and I instantly like fell in love with it. But I want to say that I've kind of been looking for something like this, like this bomber kimono slash deal. Um, I think this would be perfect for LA just because it's shorter and you know 
I love to wear bomber jackets, but it really kind of gets hot in the summer slash spring for that. With this, I would probably wear, you know, some type of white shirt. I don't really know. Um, I think like some biker jeans would be really, really cool with this and like a Chelsea boot. Or you could even do like a sneaker with it. I just love how like thick but kind of light this is. I love that it has like pockets also. This item is just a really, really dope item and I definitely suggest that you pick it up. Alright, so this next item is from Express. Um, they, these are these black rib jeans. I believe they are like $79.95. I don't remember the exact price that I pay for them. Because it's an outlet store, you always get like discounts. I mean, I'm not trying to like sell you on these jeans because I work there, but you know. You get what I'm saying. I don't know if the ribbing on the knee is like picking up on camera. However, I love these jeans. These jeans like literally like are the most comfortable jeans like I ever have worn. These like have like a little bit of a stretch in them which is good for me because I always have like issues with jeans fitting like in the thigh area, even though I don't have that big of thighs. But anyways, <laughs> um, I think these jeans are perfect for any outfit. You can do an all black outfit with this, you can do black and white. I mean, black goes with everything, so you really don't have to worry about too much of like colors clashing, cause I mean, it's a neutral. So I had to scoot in a little bit to show you this. But um, this last item I'm gonna talk about is a jewelry piece. It's this choker from Top Man. I believe this was $17. Um, like I said on my Instagram, if you, like, are not into, like, the men's choker trend, like, I need you to get on top of it because, like, it's hot. So, um, <laughs> this is this red kind of burgundy and gold, um, choker necklace and has, like, a little cross on the, um, end of it. Um, I just love this piece. I think it's super different. It basically wraps around your neck and clasps, so it's not, like, something that just clasps at the back. I think this item would be perfect to do kind of, like, a gothic inspired look. Um, I feel like you can do this with so much, especially with the gold. And I think it's just an, a nice, like, simple piece. Alright, so that is all from a men's fashion try-on haul. I hope you guys enjoyed the pieces that I showed you guys today. I hope you guys go out and pick up some of them. Um, also, if you like this video, definitely give it a thumbs up. Also, leave me a comment down below and tell me what you thought about this video. Also, subscribe to my channel, join my other fashion noobs. And yeah, I hope you guys have a blessed week. I will see you in my next video.